This PC build series is brought to you by Antec, Apotop, and Patriot Memory. Hello everybody, it's Brian for GadgetUnit.com and it's time for part 2 of my $500 PC build series and I'll be taking a look at the Antec VSK-3000 case. Thanks again to Antec for sending this over to me for this build. So it is packed very well with foam and once we remove the plastic covering we see the front. We have two 5 and a quarter inch drive bays, one 3 and a half inch bay, power reset switch, two USB 2 ports, mic in and headphone out. We also have a right side panel. In the left side panel, we do have some ventilation. You could probably mount a small 92mm fan on the side if you wanted to. And here is the back. We have a top-mounted power supply, four cutouts for our expansion slots, uh, motherboard I.O. cutout, as well as our exhaust 92mm fan. That is the only fan. The side panel is easily removable, which reveals the inside of the case. You can see that we do have ample room on the inside. We can mount two 3.5 inch hard drives and there is also a 2.5 inch SSD mount or a 2.5 inch hard drive mount. There is no front intake fan but you could put a 92mm fan in there if you would like. Overall this is a pretty roomy case. It's lightweight and it looks quite nice for the money. And that is it with this video. If you have any comments, questions, or feedback about this or anything else, feel free to leave those down below in the comments area. But that is it with the video. So thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you all in part 3.